uh, green grass right here by the wall? That is all their property. They do own that. So it always looks like this because they are attached to a well. So they always have nice grass even when we're in a drought. Now I think about it, they're awfully close to the shoreline here. They're probably pulling water right out of the ground source from the lake. So they're getting away with that. Now you guys see this little beach area? That's super nice. They have a private little beach. Most of it will be covered though when the lake fills the rest of the way up, but they will still have a little bit, so it's pretty nice. See a lot of the docks have slides off of them too, that's fun. Is the water run a little higher in, in, in springtime or in the fall time? Uh, springtime. Yeah, spring because after all the rain and stuff. Yeah. Now you guys see that walkway right there going between those two trees? You're going to see a brown A-frame at the top of that walkway. That house there used to belong to Liberace, the piano player. So as you can see, the new homeowners removed all the rhinestones. They had two boats on the lake named Piano 1 and 2. Both of them had piano keys painted around the sides. So you would have never known it was him. Ever. Weekends, this lake gets pretty crazy because of everybody's coming up to use their boats. All right, so what we're looking at here, this is all called Point Hamilton. This is like our Beverly Hills, if you will. It's all gated off. They've got security in here and everything. Now, if you buy a home in here, you sign a contract saying you will not rent it out, period. So you're not allowed to rent your house out in here if you buy one. That obviously keeps the rental people away. Partying is less. Keeps a little quieter in here. Now there was a home on the market in here for 10 million and it's dropped down to 7 million now after a couple of years. And do you see the uh, White House right here on the lawn? That house there used to belong to Dick Clark from American Bandstand up until he passed away. And just to the left, that gray house there, that is owned by Mr. Kelly of Kelly Blue Book. The guy ripped us off on our cars. He's living like that. Right, anybody have any questions? Good. All right, yes. Year round, uh, the population huh? is about, I don't know, 10,000. It's actually, I think, 11,000, close to 11,000. But summertime, it goes up to about 17 because of all the vacationers. On the lakefront, give you an idea, 15% uh, of these homes on the lakefront are lived in full time. The other 85% are vacation homes or on the market. Now, once you get off the lakefront, though, it's like 60% full time. So, once you get off the lakefront, there's a lot more. How many of you guys have seen the movie American President by chance? Anybody? Yeah. That was filmed over at the UCLA Conference Center. Anybody seen War Games? Yeah. Yeah. That was filmed up towards Snow Valley, up towards Running Springs area. Anybody seen The Parent Trap with Lindsay Lohan? Yeah. That was filmed down in Crestline, about six miles down the road. Um, at Camp Sealy, the summer camp scene, that was all filmed up here. Let's see, anybody seen Space Jam? Yeah. That was filmed on our golf course when it gets sucked down the hole. Anybody seen Next with Nicolas Cage? No? Not surprised. Well, that was